Generic greetings and welcome back to Prison Architect. In the previous episode, we got quite a lot done actually. It was a bit of a deceiving episode. We planned out the canteen and this is roughly what it's going to be. We might make some slight changes, but it's pretty much sorted. We built this entire cell block down the bottom or rather we planned it off and then built the foundations. We'd still need to add things like more entrances in there. So obviously large jail door, one, two, three keep placing them in the wrong place but there we go and then we'll build that uh, hopefully this episode we connected all the shower and did the reception and did visitation and yeah basically we got quite a lot done actually like I said it was a bit of a deceptive one but we have a bit of a problem and that is because the janitor is really pissed off and that is because they don't have anywhere to eat if I click on them I oh I actually I can't see why they're pissed off because I don't have I don't have a I don't have a psychologist, so I might hire them, but I really, I, I do actually know what the problem is, and that's because we haven't got a canteen. So I'm going to place a canteen there, and that becomes a staff canteen immediately, because in order to do that, you need to have it as staff only, which that is now set to. Originally, it wasn't set to that, but because it was behind the, uh, because it was uh, behind staff areas, it immediately sets it to a staff canteen, so that's fine. So we need the standard stuff in here. So we need a serving table, table, and a bench. So serving table can go probably there and there. And then we need tables and benches. So I'm going to put table there, table there. And actually, can we fit them in better if we do it that way? One there, one there, one there, one there. Yes, that is better. And then we can fit more in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we are. In fact, I might even shrink that up a bit to no ah, no that was correct that was correct there we are table there we are sorted um we can put things like a radio in there as well and that's important because it means they'll listen to the radio while um while they're eating um do i want to shift these actually you know what i might do i might shift them so they're just next to each other like that that's again something i don't normally do but it actually makes perfect sense and maybe something we should do in here. Let's have a rough plan. If we had it say there. Objects. So four, twelve, sixteen, twenty-four, sixteen. But we could do that. Put two more on, but that might be a bit too much. So just a row like that. So it'll be one, two, three, four in a row. Hang on. 17, that's wrong. Um, so two there and then two there. Yeah, we could. Could. Um, and just have them going straight up. That gives it more space. I don't know. That's a futurist problem. But that'll be that uh, roughly. So, the work people are cracking on over here. That's fine. Danger level is still going up. Staff morale obviously being low. But um, it's not going to be any great problem. Because as soon as this is in, we will get food delivered. In fact, we should be see... Yeah, there we go. We've got snacks coming in now. So, people are taking a break. Staff canteen is now sorted. Excellent. That's what we wanted. And they're all eating. There we go. Obviously, this still needs to be washed up, and I don't think we have any way to wash that up, so I might have to then hire a cook. I'm also going to hire the psychologist, which eventually will probably go, yeah, what a... <laughs> Inevitably, they went up here rather than the one down the bottom. Oh, well, we tried our best, so we'll place that as an office there. And danger level is now going down, but we can see from our needs that uh, staff needs is... Oh, it's bladder. Yeah, okay. So let's um, do that one as well. That's why I got this, because I thought it was going to be uh, the food, but again, I didn't think about um, the uh, that other need there. So we'll probably have some toilets in one, two, three. We should have three toilets in there with um, doors on like so. And uh, we'll have the brick wall doing that. Now, that might be a problem because it'll probably remove that as a staff area. But let's just place them and we'll see what it does. I'm going to prioritise all of that one. We need to get that done. And for some reason, can't install it. I'm guessing someone's stuck again. 
I thought I got rid of you. I did. <laughs> so why are they still there? I don't know. Anyway, that is now placed. In fact, they are now classed as staff rooms in each individual one of those. So we'll just get rid of those because we don't want that. But we do, however, want some plumbing because it's always useful to do so. And I'll connect it straight up to the sinks because... Ugh. Uh, they have uh, bladder and bowel needs, but they're not using those, and I don't know why. I'm guessing if I set them as staff only, it might work. Yes, they use that straight away. Excellent. So that should be the needs going right down. There you go. Danger level is low, and it is decreasing. That's what we wanted. Psychologist is still there. Why are you still there? Actually, I know why. Because this is now removed as an office, but I didn't place this one as an office originally, so there we go, it's now a psychologist office, and then they'll go there, then I can place that one there for the lawyer. Good! So, that should be most of that working now. So, security procedure certification, hire 10 guards, assign 3 guards to patrol routes. We could do all of that, but instead what we're going to do is get this done now. I want probably... The same for these. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to build one of them. And I'm going to copy it. I'm going to clone it along. This one I probably can't do that with. For I can't do that with the centre one. Um, but I can do it with these. Like that. Alright. Um, there we go. So I can I have to build that manually, build those manually, but once I've done those two, we can then clone it along, same as these ones. So, they're going to have the same sort of style, um, like that. Put these doors in. And they'll have a bed, which we'll place like so. And this one will be slightly different, it'll be that and that. Again, not really too bothered about the not really too bothered about like the symmetry of these. As long as they're about right. And they're all gonna have the toilets really in the same place. Um do you wanna put them against the wall? Yeah, probably against the wall is... Oh, no. Um, those will have to go there. Now the mall first the same direction. just means it's uh, easier on us. Obviously, there's no lights in these ones, which is a problem. That's why I really want an auto light. See, this one has one in, but the rest don't. In terms of the plumbing, I'll worry about the plumbing later, <laughs> quite frankly. Uh, once everything's all placed up. So we'll go for cells, there you go, and that gives us nine cells, excellent. So we'll go over to the quick build and clone, and we will clone just one of the cells, and we'll then do that. So it's not buying multiple things, it's just buying the ones I wanted, and then we'll do that. So it's not actually rebuying the wall, which is good, because that would be... Iffy. <laughs> but that'll be enough now to get our prisoner capacity over 15. And that means that we can uh, we can get, well, basically we get 20 grand and then we can go for another cell block or cell block B, which um, I believe is raise it to 50. So we won't be close to that, but once we've done this entire cell block, we'll probably be halfway there at least. I wanted to get the... I wanted to get the forestry in sooner rather than later because then that allows us to uh, it allows us to start um, building up, getting the trees and such. The problem with the forestry is that it automatically builds um, it automatically builds the trees, and if they're too close to the walls, then it can start demolishing that. Um, the size of this I probably can shrink down. I could probably shrink it like that. And it means we get more space. As long as we've got 
a gap of at least two to walk this side, then I'm not really too bothered. Um, doing that, I can then easily increase the path size to that. And then have this a little bit bigger as well. Which is now 32. And that's 33. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> I know a lot of people are quite happy that I'm not making another symmetrical prison. Quite frankly, I am too. So, I think that's going to be the play. So, we'll go for fencing. And we'll put a fence right across. Fence along. And all the way down. Obviously, entrance. I'll have a jail door there. And a large jail door there, and there, and there. And we'll do the same in here. We'll do that, but we'll also have a fence there and there, because we're going to have metal detectors. And we're not going to place any paths in here, by the way. It's just not going to happen. <laughs> no way. No way. Uh, we're going to go over to the grants once more. Uh, we've got silk B, which we will get, which is, again, another nice chunk of cash. We will... We're up to 18 now. Um, that's still not powered up. Let's just run that across and that across to there. I mean, I could just connect it up. <laughs> there you go. It's connected up. It's done. We don't need to worry about it anymore. Um, do we want to expand these cells? It would be... It might. We might as well, you know. Quick build clone. Um... We'll have to get them done anyway, at some point. And it's not going to be a lot, like a great deal of money. But quite frankly, once that's done, it really just is a case of expanding the can kitchen and canteen, getting some more guards, and then we're then we're done. Like we can get prisoners. The question is, are we going to? I think we are. I think so. I think so. Uh, we'll have the reception as access only. I think it's access only. People will try to avoid access only zones if possible, preferring to take other routes around your prison. Hmm. I don't know if reception really is access only. We'll have that as access only. There's no other route anyway, so they have to go through that. Hmm. Alright, I think... That's okay. Actually, with the amount of... We actually probably get cl uh, not close to the 50, but... It's going up. Still got another 10 cells or so to go. Yeah, I think that's the play, you know. I think it's a case of get... Get 10... Um, 10 guards. Well, get 10 guards. There you go. Sign three guards to patrol routes. So guard patrols will be... around here. There's three patrol routes and um, there's the routes. So there's another bit of money there. We've got governmental security ratings and prisoner acclimatization, which is easy to do because you need laundry and cleaning and you just need to set them to work there. So if we build the this this lump here because this is what's going to be our our laundry so a standard the door, probably in the centre actually, it's probably best in the centre and then this one's going to be roughly centralised as well. Um, and we'll have, actually that door, no, we'll probably have the door there because then we can, yeah I think we're going to dismantle that door. Right on the far left, far left. It's inefficient because you're going to come out and... Oh, no, you go around there. That's fine. That's okay. Yeah, these can be... These can be our... Laundry, cleaning cupboard, parole. So, laundry. Cleaning cupboard. And we'll put parole in later. 
Once those are in, then we're sorted, really. I think we are. Because then we've got everything that we need for the prisoners. Just putting lights in these cells that don't have them. Not that we need them, um, quite frankly. But it's nice to have them in some of these. There we are. Makes it a bit better. Yes, yeah, so I think get the laundry done, assign people to work. In fact, to be fair, we can do that now. Um, we just go to... is it, It's not in deployment, in logistics. Um, there you go. And there's that technically done. <laughs> we'll assign everybody to laundry. Oh, loads of people, all the prisoners to the laundry too. Four, six, eight, ten, twelve, that's fine. So there, there's another grant done. Uh, and manufacturing facility and governmental security ratings. Cool. We are well on our way, I think. Excellent. So, I think next episode, what we do, we finish the laundry and get all this sorted, put the pathways in, plumb all this in, and then towards that, get some prisoners. By all means, let me know what uh, prisoners you should get. I am still of the opinion that we should get probably normal risk prisoners, at least from the get-go. After that, we can expand it, and the plan is to expand this prison north, south, east, west, whatever, and uh, get you know, more, get more. I'm interested to see what shape this ends up being, these these two rivers. But that is what we've got so far. All right, I think. Not too bad at all. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.